CDC in listening to what she says and some of her behaviors, one of the things that comes out is the fact that she has to show remorse. And some of the victim's families say there is a whole following of cults. And if she gets out, it can fuel the fire, my words, not theirs, but fuel the fire for continuing behaviors that engage criminal activities. What are your thoughts? I think that's an unreasonable uh, assessment. Um, understanding how cults work and mind control would be really important for the governor to understand in evaluating this case. She was 19 at the time. She's renounced Manson. Um, she's done a tremendous amount of good while she's been incarcerated. Um, if we were judging it based on on the hurt caused and the, the heinousness of the crime alone, then no one would ever be paroled. And I think that, um, you know, the idea that she would just fall into another cult is just simply uninformed. Uh, it, it, the reason why people fall into cults is because of a variety of different factors. And um, until I hear an articulation of, of more detailed, nuanced understanding of that, I just don't agree. And there's something else to note in California, they have the elderly parole program. This means that if an inmate is 60 years old or older, then they must be given an exit date. And if they're not, then a hearing has to occur every year, which is why she has a parole hearing every year. Thank you both for your expertise. A quick 